What's up everybody? It's Carpo. Um, you know, I wanted to just make this really quick about offensive jokes. Uh, uh, namely, Polak jokes, which are actually not very uh, popular these days. Uh, it was uh, popularized after World War II, obviously. And uh, as I was grow when I was growing up, I found a book in my parents' room. It was called Outrageously Offensive Jokes. And I remember the first joke in the book. It said, why don't blacks drive convertibles? Because their lips would flap them to death. It is the worst joke that I've ever heard to this day. But as a nine-year-old kid, you look at that and think, this is what society thinks is funny? There was an insect entire section on, on blacks and Hispanics, and there was a whole section on Pollocks. You know? And to this day, I've wondered about why are the what's with all the pull jokes. And... My wife and I were just sitting here talking about it a minute ago, and I said, you know, I, I, said, I said, I wonder where the Polish jokes came from. So I looked it up, and I found that a lot of different conflicting ideas. Uh, okay, the, the term dumb Polak, according to a couple sources, uh, after World War II, when the refu refugees came to America, on the paperwork it would simply say DP, which meant displaced person. And some people began using that as dumb Polak. And then other people will, will uh, point out that many of the people, the Polish that came over here as refugees, uh, education wasn't their highest priority, so they became the dumb Polacks. Um, and I think that everybody misses this one major component of this, which I wasn't aware of until I just found this out. During World War II, Hitler sent his soldiers into Poland, and they were ordered to assassinate every scholar, every educator, every person of intelligence, and then burned down every museum, library, and school, and university. This was the root of the joke, that Hitler thought he had killed off all the intelligent Poles, so all that would be left to reproduce were the dumb ones. Of course we know that that's a bunch of bullshit. You know, just because a person is marked as intelligent on paper doesn't mean that you've killed all the intelligent people. But, I just thought I'd point that out, and, and, and this is the root of the Pollock jokes, you know, why we consider dumb Pollocks. Because someone like Hitler went in and wiped out all their intellect, and it's sad that when I hear people crack jokes like this, like Polish jokes, most people don't even know what, you know, why are you, I've never understood, why are you making fun of people from Poland? It doesn't make any sense. So, now that I know, I've never said a Polish joke, I never plan to, but I think knowing where these jokes come from a little deeper helps us to uh, be a little more respectful of one another. I haven't heard a Polak joke in years. Uh, much more popular during the 60s, 70s, but um, anyway, I just thought I'd point that out, you know, that Hitler had done that and executed all of those people of intellect, and, and it's pretty sad. Um, pretty sad part of history, it really is. Dumb Nazi jokes might be in a better interest.